Of all the countless celestial bodies and objects that grace the infinite expanses of space, black holes have always been among the most impressive. It's not only their gigantic dimensions that fascinate us, but also their unique properties that spur our amazement. Together with you, we would like to take a closer look at these legendary objects. Here, we'll go into 10 unique facts and characteristics that distinguish black holes from all other celestial bodies in space. We wish you a lot of fun with this exciting topic. Enthusiastic about the breathtaking spectacles and phenomena of the universe? Then remember to subscribe to our channel to accompany us on our galactic journey through space. With a thumbs up, you'll show us the content of our videos is engaging. Let's now take a look at the 10 most mysterious facts about black holes. The Distortion of Space and Time The fact that black holes possess incomparably extreme forces is probably already known to most of you. How enormous the influences that the massive objects exert on their immediate environment only becomes clear to us, however, if we consider one particular fact, that the unprecedented gravitational forces of black holes lead to space and time in their direct areas being distorted and or slowed down. If you were to approach a black hole at a certain distance, the prevailing gravitational forces would lead to you being pulled closer and closer to the legendary structure. If you crossed a special point on the event horizon of the black hole, you would have passed a point of no return. The extreme gravity means an escape from the inside of a black hole is practically impossible. Specifically, those objects which are sucked in by black holes undergo a so-called spaghettification. This term describes the deformation of a body in sufficient proximity to a black hole. As the name suggests, the objects will be unnaturally elongated. In the center of the massive structure, again, the singularity prevails. This means that the gravitation is so pronounced at this point that the curvature of space-time diverges practically towards infinity. Simply put, conditions prevail in the center of a black hole that completely contradict our terrestrial physics devouring objects? In our heads, we picture the imposing formations as something like galactic vacuum cleaners, which devour everything without exception. It's true that black holes possess incomparably strong attractive forces. This does not mean, however, that they suck up all planets, stars, and galaxies in their environment. For this to happen, the corresponding celestial body must first cross the event horizon of a black hole. However, if the objects are at a safe distance from the massive formations, they are not in danger of galactic collision. If there were a black hole of the same mass at the location of the Sun, instead of a bright star, our Earth would not be swallowed up by the central structure, but would continue to orbit it just like the Sun. Black holes could produce new universes. What seems at first like an almost unbelievable thesis has been discussed for some time in the ranks of experts, some of whom are of the firm conviction that black holes could actually bring new universes into existence. The breathtaking thesis is based on the prevailing singularity in the centers of black holes. This enormous compression of mass could eventually exceed a maximum point. As a result, the corresponding mass would expand explosively. This process would therefore have strong parallels to the birth process of our universe known as the Big Bang. Fascinating Emissions Black holes not only come with the characteristic property of swallowing up all objects that move into their immediate vicinity. In fact, some supermassive black holes have been recorded as emitting spitballs. Spitballs are usually planet-sized structures that form as soon as matter slips off the accretion disk of a black hole. In astrophysics, the accretion disk is the disk rotating around a central object, which guides the matter in the direction of the center of the celestial body. The accretion disk is composed of special gases or interstellar dust. Matter that slips off the accretion disk of a black hole can subsequently accumulate into coherent formations. These spitballs are then hurled through the infinite expanse of the universe at speeds of about 20 million miles per hour. The matter that always orbits just at the edge of a black hole also causes enormous amounts of energy to be released into the immediate vicinity of the fascinating celestial objects. 
As the matter reaches extreme speeds during its rotation, the resulting heating of the mass leads to an unprecedented release of energy. Invisible Colossi As already mentioned, the enormous gravitational pull of black holes exceeds all gravitational properties of the other celestial objects in the universe. This means not only that the galactic giants engulf the solid entities in their immediate vicinity, but also that they absorb light rays. Because the absorbed light cannot subsequently be readmitted from the center of the massive object, Black holes are, strictly speaking, invisible. What experts ultimately see and can prove of black holes are the extreme effects which these exert on their environment. Accordingly, at the edge of the event horizon is the silhouette of the refracted light rays. Many black holes that have been successfully added to the stellar maps were identified with the help of X-rays as researchers trace said rays back to their sources. In cases where the galactic origin absorbs more energy than it emits, the conclusion is that the object is a fabled black hole. Different Expressions One black hole is not equal to another. Researchers give the breathtaking formations different classifications. Representatives of stellar black holes originate when a massive star collapses. While the outer layers of the celestial body are ejected in the course of a supernova, the core of the star is transformed into an incomparably compact celestial body due to the immense gravitational pressure. Such a cosmic process is by no means a rarity. In our home galaxy alone, there are an estimated 100 million stellar black holes. Although these objects are often 10 times larger than our Sun, they seem almost tiny compared to their counterparts the supermassive black holes. These objects have millions or even billions of times the mass of the Sun. How exactly these gigantic objects are formed is still the subject of modern research. Supermassive black holes are found in the centers of bright elliptical galaxies, as well as in the bulge of most spiral galaxies. Our local Milky Way is also known to be one of the spiral galaxies. The supermassive black hole that graces the center of our galactic home is no less impressive than its thousands of counterparts. Sagittarius A star So the supermassive black hole that looms in the center of the Milky Way has been christened Sagittarius A star. The U.S. physicist Carl Jansky located a powerful radio source in the constellation Sagittarius as early as the early 1930s. However, it took many decades and countless series of observations before Sagittarius A star could be identified beyond doubt a few years ago. Specifically, the cosmic object has about 4.3 million solar masses, while its event horizon is just under 14 million miles. The distance between our blue home planet and Sagittarius A star is in turn 26,670 light years. Black holes as star generators We've already introduced you to the thesis that new universes might emerge from black holes. While this is still a theoretical conjecture that needs to be explored in future research, we already know that black holes are capable of forming new stars. During the matter shift of the accretion disk, enough matter can be released to form a brand new celestial body. Even more astonishing is the fact that some of these stars end up in the farthest reaches of space, far beyond their galactic birthplaces. A recently published study also suggests that black holes can not only create stars, but also have a significant impact on how many stars exist within a galaxy. Specifically, black holes are thought to influence the rates of star formation processes. Scientists have seen that star formation stops faster in galaxies whose centers are graced by comparatively small black holes. What happens to the engulfed objects? At first, it seems likely that all objects engulfed by a black hole would disappear irretrievably. However, if one closely follows the explanations of quantum physics, this is not really the case. This theory assumes that no existing information can ever completely disappear, but only be redistributed. In the case of black holes, the previously three-dimensional matter is split into thousands and thousands of two-dimensional particles, which then become part of the surface of the black hole. Thus, the entities that are sucked up by a black hole are not annihilated, but their nature is essentially recoded. What does the inside of a black hole look like? The question of what the inside of a black hole looks like will probably remain an unsolved mystery for all time. 
To solve this mystery, we would have to find a way to avert the inevitable destruction that a direct visit to a black hole would bring. The fact remains, anything sucked into the center of a black hole can never return again from there, never mind deliver a report. Now it's your turn. What fascinates you most about black holes? We're looking forward to your comments. Thanks for watching, take care, and we'll see you next time.